Yeah, good morning YouTube. So this is my little light bar that I just built and here's the electrical box that I put in to contain all my wiring in there. It's pretty much full. I'll probably have to add a little box extension if I want to mount a light dimmer on top to show you a close-up here. So here's the box. I've got my double pull, double throw switch. Here's the incoming power connection. And for this first task that I wanted to use this uh, box for is I have this little Z-Wave light dimmer module here. And I'll show you a little bit about that, give you kind of a little mini review on that item. Yeah, here's a close-up of the backside of the device. Show you that first. Here's the wiring connections. What you have here is the center line and neutral connections there are for AC power and then the outer connections are for your load. Over here you can actually wire up a switch. You've got a, a 3 volt power connection here that you can use if you want to rig up a three-way type switch, you know, multiple switches. So you can have your runner here from this device running out to another switch and then back and then through this switch. So this is low voltage here. It's Here's your Z-Wave antenna. So I think these run at uh, 900 megahertz roughly. And then here's your pairing button. You can use this switch if you hook up an external switch or you can use this action button. So let me show you the other side that has the part number information here. Yeah, here we go. So this is from Aeon Labs or Aotech. So this is what they call this Micro Smart Energy Illuminator. This is the Generation 2 device. There's a Generation 3 device currently available. I purchased this maybe a year and a half ago. So you can see here the model DSC19103-ZWUS. I think that's Z-Wave United States and you can see the frequency there. The frequency will vary in different countries so you have to make sure to get the right frequency for your country and then as well the voltage 120 volts 60 Hertz will of course vary in different countries and this one right there it says for use with incandescent lamps so that's something I wanted to find out about. Does it actually work with LEDs or is it incandescent only? And just a note about wire sizes. So these terminals for the switch work with 18 gauge wire. So they're quite small. These other terminals here for the line and load, 14 gauge is about the largest you can put in here. If you're trying to use this on a 20 amp circuit, which uses 12 gauge wire, you've got to use pigtails in here. 14 just barely fits, and in fact 16 fits a lot better, and that's what I used in here. That's the Aotech Micro Smart Energy Illuminator G2. So this is a light dimmer, the illuminator part, and then the smart energy means this device can read power consumption going to the load and then it can also accumulate kilowatt hour energy consumption for that device. That is kind of nice and it's all remote control and to do that you've got to pair it with your Z-Wave controller so I'll show you that next. 